Recording Mahindra Bank, if you just tuned in, has agreed to buy 15% stake in MCX from Financial Technologies. The deal reduced FTIL's holding in MCX to about 5%. Prerna is standing by to give us more details about this deal and the possible roadblocks. Prerna. Well, FTL stake in MCX has now come down to 5% post the sale. Kotak Mahindra Bank has picked up FTL's 15% stake in MCX for a total consideration of 459 crore rupees. Now, Kotak Mahindra Bank has bought FTL's 15% equity stake in MCX, which is valued at 600 rupees per share. Remember, MCX's IPO listing was at 1032 rupees per share. So, Kotak Bank's investment is at a discount of 24% percent from Friday's closing price of MCX. Now, the deal, however, is subject to regulatory approvals. Remember, as per SEBI's ICDR guidelines, FTIL's 20 percent stake in MCX is locked in as promoter's contribution till March 2015. Uh, so, we learned that uh, financial technology has sought clarity from SEBI on the three-year lock-in clause under ICDR regulations. Uh, we also learned that the commodity markets regulator, FMC, has also sought clarity from SEBI on the ICDR regulations for the stake sale to go through. FMC has sought relaxation so that its uh, not fit and proper order against FTIL can be complied with. Remember, FMC in its December order had declared FTIL not fit and proper and directed it uh, to reduce its stake in MCX to 2%. Also, as per FMC's revised shareholding guidelines, only commodity exchanges, stock exchanges and banks and public financial institutions can hold up to 15% in commodity exchanges.